Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Gravoxy. We're going to do a nice little workout this morning, so I'd like you to get nice and comfortable. Take a deep breath in through your nose, and let's get started. Exhale through your mouth. Just relax and do your health bounce. We're just going to let the body pump for a couple minutes, and we're going to focus on the breathing. Breathe in through your nose. Feel the body expand, and then exhale. Breathe in through your nose and exhale through your nose and exhale as we're doing our little health bounce for two minutes i want you to think happy thoughts feel joy when you breathe in exhale breathe in and breathe out breathe in and breathe out breathe in and breathe out Good, let's just rock to your left side and keep breathing in and exhale out. Breathe in and breathe out. Go to your right side. Breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out. Good, now we're just gonna rock side to side. a real like hard muscle movement we're just warming up so shift your hips nice to the side to the front To the ceiling, nice and easy. If this bothers your shoulders, don't lift too high. Keep breathing through your nose and out your mouth. And back to the front. Good, and back to your health bounds and just let the arms go forward and back. Nice and easy. Breathe in, breathe out. One more. Good, let's do a little internal, external hip rotation. Warm up those hips. Keep your right knee soft and just let that left leg move. You're gonna feel the rotation in your ribs and your shoulders. Let your head go with it a little bit. Just relax. Keep this knee soft. And if you need to pivot with it so you don't put any torque on the knee, that's fine. And switch. Just bounce. Push a little bit more this time. And as you're doing this, I want you to pull your abdominal muscles in, okay? Just, just so you feel a little bit of that contraction of holding your muscles in. This is your transverse abdominals. The other way you can do it is taking your two fingers, sticking them under your ribs, push in the fingers into under your ribs, and then push out and then contract the muscles. Another way is just <coughs> cough. You'll get that feeling of the transverse abdominals. Okay, you ready? We're just gonna do a little tap walk, bounce walk, or you can go into a shuffle. Dead arms forward. Arms up. And now just power walk. And if this is your first time doing this, so I want you to pay attention to tightness in the chest, lightheadedness, any nauseousness. I mean, that might sound horrible to hear, but these are all detox and thresholds. So the detox process and the thresholds. If your calf muscles get tight, you can come off and do a nice, easy little calf stretch. 
Good, let's go into a nice easy little jog. Speaking of nice easy. Breathe into your nose and out your mouth. And cross it over. Roll the arms with it. You can always slow this down if it's too fast for you too, but if you want to increase it, you can increase it. Breathe slow and move fast. Good, come forward. Let your body do that natural little twisting that it does when you're moving your hips and you're doing a jog. Don't try to hold it tight. We want to spiral that energy up. Open up all your chakra energy. Now take a deep breath in and exhale slowly. Deep breath in. We want to get more oxygen into the body. Breathe in and out. Breathe in. And breathe out. Good. Now rock side to side. Shift. Shift, shift. Get those heels down. Now doubles. Tap it. Tap. You can bring your arm all the way up if you'd like. If it's too much on your shoulders, keep it forward. Breathe in and out slowly. Inhale, exhale. Now take the arms to the side. Same thing here, don't lift them too high if it bothers your shoulders. Get that slathening. Four more, three more, two, last one, singles. Now take your knees to the side. We like to call this the happy farmer. Actually the kids named it the happy farmer. Too much, just lower the intensity. Arms forward. Let's do a single, single, double. Single, single, double. So it's a one, two, and hold. One, two, and hold. Breathing. Inhale, exhale. Circles. 
and the breathing. Good. Now let's twist. If you can't do a twist, you can do one leg for four and then switch. So count yourself a couple of fours on each side. Now let's do a double. Yeah. at the bottom of the bounce. Because when you come down, one and two G-forces, that's where the G-forces is, at the bottom of the bounce. Hence, don't do this. <laughs> you don't need to do that. Your natural body weight is going to stretch and strengthen those cells. Alternate the arms. Keep jumping or bouncing. You can jump a little higher. That makes a little more G-force. Reach. Good. Now go into your jumping jacks. Remember to modify it if it's too much. Arm side. Four, three, two, both arms out and in. Good. To the front. Five, six, alternate. Nice job, ladies, a little coordination, and gentlemen. Last two. Last one. Hold the arms forward. Let's go. Now stay with me here or you can do the abduction work. Modified abduction, just tap the side or just do the jacks. Let's go. Arm side, careful. A little more balance here. This is a little bit more intense. I might make it look easy, so make sure you do the modification. You're also going to see which side of your body has uh, more strength for the balance. Both arms. Shoulders. If you have problems with your shoulders, here. Root chakra, all your chakras, and out the crown. 
and forward. Okay, just jump or bounce, front to back. Now modified is just step it. Good job. Stay with me here or angle. You've got to get the feet up in the air to do the angle. That's it. So it's more jumping or just walking. elbows back. Good. Now lift it up. Press your shoulder blades. Nice. Let's just do a two minute sprint and then we're going to grab some water. Let's go. Breathe in and breathe out. You can modify this to a slower sprint or you can pick it up, but the breathing is slow and exhale slow. Feel how your breath is. If it's too hard to do that, slow down. Now you don't want to just stand in one place, so let's move around. Sprinting. I like this one because it really works those lateral muscles of your core. So today might be the day you go to the beach and it snows. <laughs> Snowing now and it'll be what, almost 50 degrees in a little while. Gotta love New England. Keep breathing slow. Exhale. Move those feet. One more minute. I'm kind of guesstimating. Move those feet, all different patterns. Good. 30 seconds. those arms. Get that fascia all stretched out. Move those arms around. You get 15 seconds. Stretch. Stretch up. Move. Breathe. Stretch on the breath. Five, four, three, two, and one. 